Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm at Costco. I am buying work clothes from Costco. It's so funny because when I was younger, I would never buy clothes from Costco. But now, like, I'm like, they got good quality, they got good prices, and they have a lot of options. They have stuff that I like. So anyway, I thought I would bring you guys along so you guys can see, like, all the deals they have, you know, as far as work clothes, as far as um, just casual lounging clothes, which is what I need for my new job. Stick around so you guys can see what outfits I find at Costco. Oh okay, so you want a fruit smoothie, Erika? That's a fruit smoothie, Erika. Okay, so one fruit smoothie and, and one, what kind of ice cream? Just some yogurt one. This one or this one? The yogurt. And one very berry. Okay. And pay for your order. Okay. two shirts I found this one it's like a light color it's really cute nice and loose I'm going in a double X so it could fit me nice and loose and look how cute those little buttons are this is $11 I love it the quality is great okay this shirt is also $11 this one's looser which I really like how loose it is again it has the little buttons but no buttons in the front it's just I mean it's just like really really cute so they also have these shirts right here for $9.97 Okay, because of the job I'm going to be doing, I don't know if this is like presentable for the job. I think that I should like, I need to be covered as covered up as possible. Then again, I could always wear like a jacket. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to go with those. I have to, again, I have to be as covered up as possible. And I feel like this little lace kind of comes off as sexy in a way, right? Like, I just have to be as covered up as possible. I really want a sweatsuit, Faith. I think this is going to be my big splurge. I would love the burgundy one, Faith. I really, really want a sweatsuit. Um, I really like these sweatsuits. So it's going to be a $30 sweatsuit, which I think is pretty good. This brand is pretty good. I've had it before. Um, one of my main concerns when I buy sweatsuits that are velvet on the outside or the inside, and this isn't like too uncomfortable, like the material is kind of soft. So yeah, I really, really like these sweatsuits. The problem is I really like burgundy. Like that's the color that I would hope to get, but they don't have any more. So I might just go with the black one. I don't know. I want to look real quick on What should I do? Let me see the black one. Let's see what the black one looks like and maybe, oh my goodness, you guys, look at this cute jacket. Wow, this is like really, really cute. It's a size small, which is not gonna fit me. <laughs> so, whatever. Okay, let's see the sweatsuit. They also have like a navy blue, which I don't mind. But, so, these are the pants. And this is something that I'll wear all winter. So that's why I'm like, you know, it's nice and cozy. Yeah, the inside is really soft. If you look at the inside, it's like really, really soft. And let's try and find a honey. I can only find mediums. These things sell out so fast. They don't have my size and I'm freaking heartbroken. So this shirt is really cute. It's like a little pullover sweater. It's nice and loose and big. And I don't know, I think I, I think I might go with this. What do you guys think? It's really cute. Except I I mean I really honestly wanted the purple just because I already have a blouse with this color. I mean, it's not the same color, but it's in the family, and I just, yeah, I wish. I might not get this, this is a maybe, but they don't have the purple in my size. They don't really have too much for me here. I don't think I'm gonna go with this. I mean, it's $9, which is not expensive, but I don't know like, if I'm gonna go with that. I'm still thinking about it. This shirt, I don't think I'm gonna go with it either. I don't know. 
Maybe I should just take them. Let's see what kind of shoes they have. It all depends on the shoes. And we are now approaching the shoes. <gasps> I honestly love like their shoes that they have here. Like I think they have the cutest shoes and I think they have the best deals like all the time. Like, look at those men's shoes, $12. Like, you can't go wrong when you buy sh shoes from, from Costco. Okay, they also have Menfilas, $12. Like that's crazy. Reebok for 19 and they have these Speedo shoes and they're only $5 because a lot of times they do like liquidation where they try and get rid of it. They don't promote their clearance, but they always have clearance. So they have kids Adidas shoes. Wow, for $23, it's insane, insane. They have these Reeboks. There's literally no price and I need a size 11. I don't know if they have them. They're like really cute though. Look how cute they are. They look so comfortable. I don't think they're gonna match all my clothes, which sucks. I was really hoping to get like some black shoes, but I don't think I'm gonna have that luck of finding them here today. But I just need something for this week. And again, it depends on the price. I might just go to like Ross or something after this if they don't have what I'm looking for. And if these are like 20 bucks, I'm not gonna take them just because this is not what I'm looking for. I want some black shoes so they match like all my clothes. But again, if they're a good price, I will not mind going with these. Okay, 8.5. Literally, the story of my life is always looking for shoes in my size because no one carries the size. And that is exactly why I'm gonna miss Payless so much. Like Payless, I can just go in there, buy a pair of shoes. They always had my size. They were always organized together. And now there ain't no more Payless. They did not have anything that I was looking for. I they have no shoes. They have a bunch of men's. Okay, so we're gonna go with this blouse. Should I go with this one? I like this one. Did you like that? Oh, so sorry. Okay, so I'm going with this one, this one, this one, and this one. But I'm also gonna need some short sleeve blouses, so I'll find those at Ross or Target. Literally, you guys, the shopping trip was available, but we're gonna go to Ross. <laughs> Dress for less. How corny can I be? Come here, hon. That was Ross. No, we're not going to Five and Below, baby. Do you want to go look at the Halloween costumes at Five and Below? Or is that a whole different video? <laughs> no, go on that first. Okay, so we're at Ross, and we're gonna check out what they have. Yeah. Okay, this is like really cute, you guys. Oh, it's only ninety dollars. I love that so much. I'm literally like looking for these. No. Like these are cute, and these will match with everything. These are cute, huh, Faith? These are thirty bucks. Is that how much they cost? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that was my plan B. I was planning to get like some sketchers that I can just like slide my foot in. Or what about these, Faith? These have a hill in them. I could be rocking and rolling. Rocking and rolling. Who says that? They have these. But like. Why Here, Faith, can you hold my purse? Which one again? No! We both look up at the stick like, how can we get my purse over? Let's see. Yes. Yes. See, these are like so cute. <laughs> these are like Nautica shoes. I don't know if I like that brand. Like, I don't think they're gonna last. I don't know. I never had them, but they don't feel too well made. And this, like it's already coming apart right there. That's not a good sign. But this is actually what I was looking for like sketchers like that. That's what I thought they were gonna have, but like without shoelaces, which, oh, those don't have shoelaces. But, preferably I would like Adidas if they're the same price. I mean, why not? These are a size 11. You guys, I really like these. They're so comfortable. Oh my God, let me see this dress. I saw Rosie Molina wearing a pattern like this. Oh my God, I think this was like, almost like the dress. But she looks so beautiful. You guys follow Rosie Molina. She is just so vintage, so in touch with that. Look at this, this kind of look vintage. So pretty, huh? Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Go. So we decided that we are not taking this stuff yet. 
I still want the shoes, but I'm gonna see what they have in Target because ultimately I really wanted something that my foot would just slide in. So let's go to Target. So I found these, which are super cute. They're black, which is what I wanted. So I'm gonna match with everything, but I just don't know if I'm gonna find my size. The pink ones are actually on clearance, which I really like the pink ones. But I feel like I'm always gonna be like, that doesn't match. I already know myself. I think they're all on clearance. No way. Hi. Should I just get these? I freaking would. So here's how I feel about these. They're $24.99. They're not name brand. They're, I mean, they're kind of cheap. I mean, they're Target. They're not comfortable here. This is something I have to be wearing and walking and standing in. They're cute, but they're not gonna work for what I need. Can you relate? Have you ever went shopping when you're broke? Shopping for stuff like, I don't know, groceries at Target or whatever, but you have a set budget for whatever your issue is. And literally, you walk by the clothes just to kind of like window shop or whatever, and they have so much stuff, like everything you touch is something you would wear. And then when you actually come shopping for clothes, they don't have anything. Like that's the story of my life. I really wanted Skechers. You know those cute little like ones that you see like all the grandmas wearing? Like those are the ones I want because those are comfortable. Like they know what they're doing, the grandmas. They've been doing it for years. I am shopping for cleaning supplies because I'm planning the ultimate cleaning video. So make sure you guys check that out. I should have uploaded it on Monday, so it should be up by now. You guys, we are still at Target. That's usually how it goes when we come here. It's really hard for us to leave. I think we're, I'm ready to leave. <laughs> I guess this whole this whole shopping trip was a fail.